Welcome to the Employer Solutions Portal online tutorial. In this tutorial, we will be reviewing how to add members to a random pool. During the tutorial, I will refer to the Employer Solutions Portal as ESP. We will begin by logging into ESP. At the login page, enter your username and password and click the secure sign in button. After successful login, you will see the dashboard for your organization. If permissions are enabled, you will see the randoms menu on the left navigation. Select randoms to navigate to the pool summary page. All random pools created in your organization will appear on the pool summary grid. To expand the pool detail and add members, select the plus sign next to the pool name. In the expanded pool detail, select the member list button. The member list can be created by entering pool member detail manually or by importing a CSV file. To create the member list by importing a CSV file, select the Import Members button. Columns required in the import file are listed on the page. To access a template for use in creating a file, select the User Template hyperlink. Select the magnifying glass icon then choose File to browse your computer for a file to import. When you have chosen the file to import, select the Next button. A sample of the data in your file will be presented to confirm your columns have been mapped to the primary ID, first name, and last name field correctly. Select the Import button to import the members from your file to the member list. A confirmation window will indicate how many members will be added to your list. Confirm that you wish to proceed with the import by selecting the Yes button. All of the member records in your import file will now be displayed on the pool member list for this pool with the current date in the Date Added column. All members in the pool are now eligible for random selection. To create the member list by manual entry, Select the Add Member button. Enter the primary ID, first name, and last name of the member in the required fields and select the Save button. The member will now appear in the member list with the current date in the Date Added column. To remove a member from the member list, select the minus sign on the row of the member. A confirmation window will require that you select the Yes button to remove the member. The current date will be displayed in the Date Removed column and this member will not be eligible for random selection. This completes this Employer Solutions Portal online tutorial.